be on Twitter like when he gon' miss. Say I fell out, but I fell in this boot. The white flag, I ain't telling him. I play it cool and hand Brody the blitz. Got your stew just to show you I'm rich. Now you can't drop no new music. How you jump right on that song and it snitch? You sassy and wrong as a Say the wrong thing and get put on that list. This is a warning, cause savage don't this. Better thank me that your to exist. Cause Jesus can't save you from what's in your stick. You don't look good without makeup on. Welcome, everybody, to an Amide Sports Media production. I'm t uh, we're bringing to you the boys' 2024 by district games, by district playoff game, boys soccer, where it will be Alma Heights Meals versus the South uh, Southwest Legacy Titans. Now, what a contest we're, we're coming up right now, as we have these both of these guys warming up with around eight minutes, eight minutes to go. So let's let's talk about both. Let's start first talk about Southwest Legacy and see how how have they done over. So right now we're looking at the stats. Overall, Southwest Legacy is 11, 11 wins, eight lo uh, losses, and three ties. Overall, in the district in district play, eight wins, three l losses, and three ties, which leaves them in second place in their district. Now for some. Uh, right now, for goals per match, for you guys, we should be looking out for is a link for the uh, for what Alma Heights should be looking out for is Arinke Casas with 1.1 1 .1 goals goals a match. Christian Ovalle Ovalle and Jose Jose Rodolfo Ibarra. And it says per match, we should also be looking out for Derek Lozano, Eric Banda, and Sebastian Mendoza. So they're definitely a team who's been you know, looking at. Uh, looking out, he's definitely been through the tough times, but has definitely can be able to put up a fight. All right, now for the Alma Heights Mules, they're 20 with 20 wins and th only three losses, no ties. As you can, as some of the games we've covered, we've probably seen them go into to penalties, and they were going to be, they were in second, they were second overall, but. They lost. Uh, they were. They were could have been first, but they, the only two losses they have were against for district play. The only two losses they have was against MacArthur, which that was a, cu a couple weeks ago. Now leaves them second place in district. Now some guys we should be looking out for. We have Yoji Phillips. We have Diego Magico and Joshua Joshua Sharp. And for the for the goals and the attack, and then we have our assists. We have Logan Baker, also Joshua and, and Diego Madrigal, and then and for saves, Ethan Davila for goalkeeper has been making a really a bunch of good saves for the meals, and he's definitely been helping them out for for them. He's a senior, by the way. And lots of the, and lots of these guys are also seniors. Same with the girls. Now we have around five, a little bit. A little bit uh, over five minutes left to go before the kickoff. So sit back, relax, grab some something to drink, something to eat, and also something to snuggle with. Yeah, I know you're probably watching this in bed. You should probably be doing something. But honestly, you should probably be watching this because this is uh, this is the first round. We're getting in it. Meals versus Titans coming up on Outline Sports Media.
Welcome to Harry B. Orham Stadium and to the Bay District Championship first round of the 2024 UIL State Soccer Playoffs. Competing in today's match will be Southwest Legacy Titans in, in white, coached by Coach Juan Sandoval versus the Alma Heights Meals in blue, coached by Coach Jason Perez and Coach Braden Gold. We'd like to welcome our visitors and thank everyone for attending today's game. These gentlemen have worked hard and sacrificed many hours in order to prepare them for competition, and we'd like to wish them all good luck by showing our support, encouragement, and respect for each team competing and the referees officiating. Playing for the Titans tonight will be Nunez Rivalca, uh, da David Nunez Rockerval, Neric Lozano, Jose Rodolfo Ibera, Cano Esquivel, Oliver Mendoza, Alex Erazo, Andres Alvarez, Christian Ovalle, Sebastian Mendoza, Edson Gutierrez, Eric Banda, Derek Lozano, Enrique Casas, Alejandro Macias, Giovanni Leiva Rodriguez, Jordi Mendez, Joshua Cueva, Alex Guzman, Brandon Elizondo, Brandon Elizondo Rangel, Joshua Bayer, Oscar Montes, Zevean Castaneda, and Desmias Rodriguez. That was the that was Southwest Legacy Titans. Now for the meals, double zero, Sha Shashi Gomez, number zero, Raymond Lerma, number one, Ethan Davila, number two, Yoji Phillips, number three, Linus Flores, number four, Noah Gentles, number five, Miguel Urbina, number six, Cash Alvarado, number seven, Solomon Nathan, Number eight, Diego Alvarez. Number nine, Diego Madrigal. Number 10, Joshua Sharp. Number 11, Logan Baker. Number 12, Theo Hervey. Number 13, Greg Monagas. Number 15, Finn Keenan. Number 16, Jackson DeLeon. Number 17, Jackson Cummings. Number 18, Graham Shannon, number 19, uh, number 20, Damon Griffin, number 21, Ayush Sharma, number 22, Alan Moreno, number 23, Santiago Berenger, number 24, Cole Ro Roos, number 26, Carlo Daniel, number 27, Joaquin McCullough, and number 28, Alan De La Torre. Officiating tonight will be referees Jose uh, D'Ambrosio, I mean Simon, and Alex Alleman. Good luck, players and coaches. And thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for attending tonight's match. Sit back and enjoy the game. <laughs> yeah. Raymond Lerner was repeated twice. <laughs> so I was I got confused a second. A lot of <laughs> Seriously. He was I think it depends on if he's um Oh sorry, that was it You heard it here folks, that was just the lineup for both sides playing. For tonight's matchup of Almighty Meals versus Southwest Legacy Titans. And by the way, I need to introduce myself. I'm Taj Young. I'll be your commentator for tonight as we get ready for the first round of playoffs as the captains are meeting each other on the center logo, introducing themselves, getting ready for tonight's amazing matchup. I hope you guys are ready to enjoy this. I'm sure I am. It is currently 8.09 p.m. in Central San Antonio. Right now, the right now, uh, Right now, the temperature is around 65 degrees. 
clear. It's a little bit chilly as we're heading into the evening with a little bit of wind chill. So we are definitely ready for tonight. So make sure if you're out there, we're, some, we're something warm. So as we get these guys. All right, they're getting ready. All right, now, oh, yes, I, yeah, I just it. All right, we see the ref getting ready. Getting ready to get his laps around the corner, getting his warm-ups ready, because, shoot, those guys need a stretch. They'll be, running, they'll, be, they'll be running in, no substitutions as well. As I'm joined here in the press box with the timekeeper of tonight, Last Bradley, he'll be, you probably will be hearing some comments from him tonight. <laughs> as we were making some choice, as both teams are in the huddle, getting ready. Now, I've been saying this, I am feeling, I feel excited for playoffs. I always love the atmosphere of playoffs for any sport. I run cross country, so I'm telling you playoffs for cross country, it's definitely intense. All right, here we go, getting ready for the kickoff, who we have going. Looks to be Southwest Legacy will be hanging this off. Going in for the first. About to start off the first half. 40 minutes on the clock. With a thumbs up from the referee. Confirming with the with the timekeeper. We are ready to go. And blow the whistle. Kick it off. And here we go. Immediately going into Alma Heights side. It'll be out on Southwest Legacy. Who do we have for me throwing it in? All right. There we go, Noah Gentle is kicking it. Back off to Noah Gentle's going in. That was Yoji Phillips throwing it in. Going in. 21, I need Shawarma. Kicking it back off. Yoji Phillips, close with the header. Header off of, there we go, Yoji Phillips. Going in to Santiago Berenger. Back off to Shorma. There you go to Linus Flores. Out on Linus Flores. Hitting a start. All right. Throwing it in. Going. And we close one. Ooh, caught by the goalie for tonight. Going in. You're calling for it. You're like, Shorma. Now, this is definitely from a t the difference between the boys and the girl girls. There's definitely more pressure, more of of intensity. Now, I'm not saying there's no intensity for the girls, but there's something different between for the boys' side, especially on a colder night like this. All right, Josh Sharp was going in for that, but you couldn't get it. It'll be kicked out by... All right, Eddie Schwarmer going in, Josh Sharp. Coming back to Yoji Phillips. There we go. Coming back in. Get, get, get back. And oh, had to kick it out. Not facing the right direction. There we go. That was the first couple minutes in the half. And there's definitely some different excitement going on. All right, Jackson Cummings with it. Josh Sharp coming past it, kicking it back. 
No Gentles. Going in, Linus Flores. Get off. No Cash Alvarado. There you go. It's Santiago Berenger. Trying to get the ball. There you go. Set of it. <clears throat> Southwest Legacy. Diego Alvarez. There we go. Santiago Berenger. To Diego Madro. Now kicking it back off of Josh Sharp. Going in. Could it be a 10 for a first goal of the night? Here it is. The corner off of. Going in. Santiago Berenger. And it's a goal. First goal of the night. Santiago Berenger. 1 nil. There we go. I'm sure he's feeling great for himself there. I was talking to him earlier. He ran cross country with me back, uh, back in the fall. He's definitely having that passion. <laughs> and definitely for a long distance runner. All right, here we go. Something to you see. Going back out. Goalkeeper gets it. Goal is a little bit putting across onto the meal's end. This is interesting for such a goal. Well, definitely, if he's going in. We see a bunch of these guys curled up together. And that is definitely true. You call it right there. He's definitely have a big leg going in. And it will be a penalty off the meal's. Southwest Legacy will get a kick. All right, let's see this. All right. Oh, fake, fake, third one to the pass. Going in, let's see if they can get it in. Header, oh, close. It still got it. Can the Mules be able to kick it out? And they kick it off to the side. What a play by Southwest Legacy. Showing in some trickery for the Mules. Some shablam, some spice. Not everything nice. Josh Sharp kicking it back over to double zero. Going back in. Jackson Cummings with the header. Josh Sharp cutting across. Clips him. Clips like a South Lizzie kid. No penalty. Penalty is called against Alma Heights. They'll get a second. Now another kick for South Lizzie Legacy. And we haven't even started. We haven't even passed 10 minutes. All right, we'll see here. Goes for it. Oh, what an arm on him. Oh, getting way too close to the line. Can be able to kick it back out. Yoji Phillips get in. You'll be going in. The attack going back to the goalie. Go try to block. Go in. Try to get back. Josh Sharp with a little spin. Gets the ball back. Oh. Cone it back off of Josh Sharp. I restart the ball. There you go. Diego, Mag Diego Alvarez will be now kicking it. The ball was still rolling. 
when Josh Sharp touched it, so he didn't get to stop going in. What a leg off of Diego Alvarez. That was insane. I forget these guys can just kick it from just the, from midfield like no care in the world. We saw with that goalie going across the midfield line. Going in. All right, here we go. Pressure putting in on from Southwest Legacy going up against Jackson Cummings. Going to pass off of... Going to be out. Southwest Legacy, Jackson Cummings was at the throwing in. Going in, Yoji Phillips. Going back in, Josh Sharp. Try to find Santiago Berenger. Berenger going in. Kicking it back out. Try to find Yoji with a header. Goalie gets it. That'll be out on Sunday on Southwest Legacy. Jackson Cummings with the throwing in. Better. I'm always putting pressure on him, trying to get the ball going back. Yoji Phillips going in. Going to cross. Oof. Trying to find. No kid in Alvarado with that header. Along with Linus Flores. But yeah, thrown in by Solid Legacy. Going for the ball. Pressure being put on by Diego Alvarez. And... And... Uh, oh, close. And... Oh! Collision. Yellow card. Southwest Legacy number three. Oof. What a collision by that. That's something. Yeah, playing hard. And I guess it was accidental. He didn't he didn't get his head up in just in time for it. It wasn't he wasn't just doing it on purpose. Especially not, in a, especially in a very important game like this, with one nil. But it's also, you can definitely tell that Southwest Legacy, after that one goal, did kind of poke the poke the buttons in the wrong way. We'll see how they respond. Linus Flores with a the kick. There you go, by Linus Flores. Oh, with the stop, going back in. Throw it down the field. Get it back to. I'm a Heights. They're throwing in. It'll be Jackson Cummings. All right. It's also as he get back. Diego Alvarez trying to get the ball. Josh Sharp putting contestant on them. Same with Linus Flores down there. Getting it back. There you go. Cash Alvarado. Get it back down. Yoji Phillips trying to get the header in. There we go. Dang. What a leg on this kid. Well, this kid's probably my age, but still insane. All right, here we go. Going back down. Yo, Santiago Berenger. Here we go. Close off the leg of Diego Madrigal. Very close. I know. Put off of Josh Sharp is call is getting ready for play. I'm sure he's gonna be in this one. We'll see. Going in, finds where Josh Sharp was supposed to be. Going in, we out. South goalkeeps rolls it in. Tells these guys to get closer together. I'm sure he's getting they're ready for the play. Goes down off of the head of Ayu Shorma. But can't get it back, so now it'll be Southwest Legacy's ball.
Dang, just... <laughs> What a leg on these guys from midfield. All right, going in very too close. Offsides and those offsides off of uh, Southwest Legacy. I might as well get the ball back. You got to wait for that. We've seen this with the girls. But honestly, we want Alma Heights to, to win. I'm not being bipartisan. You're watching Alma Heights Sports Media, so I'm going to have a little bias. Uh, here we go. Southwest Legacy going off. Jackson Cummings in it. Josh Sharp going, sneaking in. Cummings in it, picking it back out. Yoshi Phillips on the, trying to get the ball. Oh, dang. The goalkeeper kicks it all the way back to the 15-yard line. And it'll be out on Ama Heights. <laughs> Area. Oof. There you go. I'm a heights ball. There you go. Pre kick. Cash Alvarado. Ooh. The slide pass back down to, to Linus Flores. Kicking it back down to trying to find Santiago Berenger. Yoji Phillips trying to go in and back to Berenger. Josh Sharp trying to get it back out. Can it get it off of Alma Heights' end? And it'll be called Heights Ball. Another kick for Heights. This time it will be Linus. Linus Flores with that. Off of. Southwest. Oh, here you go. First up of the night. Santiago Berenger will be going out. Coming in for him will be. Alan Moreno, and also looks to be another sub out. He's now be th he'd be throwing it in. Or is he closer to our goal? Goalkeeper gets it. Oof! Two oh, throws it down to number seven, and it will be Southwest Legacy's ball. Off of Diego Madrigal. Going out. We'll see. And it will be out. Mule's ball. Now, this time, we we're going to see we, most of it for the girls. It was on the Southwest Legacy end. But now for the boys, we've seen more, most of the ball on. Actually, I think it's been more fairly even on both sides. All right. Here we go. Throw in. Going and throwing with all his might. Kicking it back out. It was Lo Logan Baker will be Logan Baker or something. All right, here we go. And then, oh, they're calling it clean. No call from the ref. Ball is still in, in play. Diego Alvarez trying to sweep in. Josh Sharp trying to get around. He's trying to find Yoji Phillips. And it'll be out. Sorry, trying to find Diego Madrigal. All right, throwing in will be Diego Alvarez as the meals are getting themselves situated, getting ready for the play. Oh, oof, close head interaction between number two, Yoji Phillips, and Southwest Legacy. Going back down. Going in for the play. Off the foot of Cash Alvarado. Up in the air. And it'll be out. Oh. Ref's blowing definitely trying to get the guys away. This is something you got to keep these guys separated because you get too close. These guys will definitely are in very emotional states and will definitely put up a fight. All right, here you go. We actually feel pushing in. Accidentally shoves into it's that guy from Southwest Legacy. 
Uh, Moreno's foot's going in, trying to find Diego Madrigal. Back to trying to find Logan Baker, a little bit too ahead of him. Can Logan Baker be able to run, get ahead, and close, trying to off the head, clipping it out? That will be, sounds like Ozzy's ball. It looks like the goalkeeper is going for it. Next to the pole vault pits. Mats. All right, off the foot, going in, trying to find Jackson Cummings. Going up, Logan Baker looking to f a little bit out, though. All right, here we go. Throw in. Jackson Cummings finds, ooh, looks to be you, you, you Phillips. Going back out. All right. Now we're almost reaching. We have two minutes left before the halfway point of the first half as we get another throw in. All right. Long kick by Lions Flores, and it'll be out. South Southwest Legacy's ball. Going down. Off the head of Cash Alvarado. Got three meals fighting over it. Yoji Phillips is trying to get into it. Could be Diego Madrigal, though. Josh Sharp gets it. There we go. R refs didn't call a hand. On that, it definitely could have touched it, but you know, the refs sometimes they only call what they see. And also, these guys are high school level, you gotta remember that. And it'll be out again after the ref called it out. He gets he still kicks it. But yeah, these refs are at a high school level, but they, this is a playoff game, so you want you want them to be at the best capacity. All right. Ooh, almost clipped off the foot, Josh Sharp. All right. Southwest Legacy is still putting pressure in. Mules are trying to get out of their... They're in, putting it, doing as much as they can. Aisha Sharma gets it to Dega Madrigal, kicks it all the way up to almost to get to intended for Yoji Phillips. Dega Madrigal goes it back in, goes it, passes it up to Logan Baker. Logan Baker tries to get Yoji Phillips going back in. Oh. Going back. Now we're going to head back to the, uh, to the meals end of the field. All right, here you go. Southwest Legacy getting back in, and it'll be out on them. Yellow card for. Looks to be Josh Sharp is going off the. F oh, that'll be. All you know is there's a kick for for Southern's Legacy after a yellow card on the meals. We'll see who the substitution in after this play goes. Goes in. Not once, not twice, but three times to get the kick. They're getting close. Oh, and it'll be out. Every time. You don't know if it works or if it doesn't. Yes, it looks pretty, but I guess they should probably be looking more at where they're kicking than what they're doing. It's like when Michael Terry tries to 
tries to jump over every single d defensive back he can see. All right, Cash uh, Alvarado going down. Here we go, coming up the field. It's going to be Logan. No, it was Josh Sharp, off of Josh Sharp. All right. South Atlantic sees ball after the meals. Oh, and by the way, the substitution, Greg Monagas will be in for in the game now. As we have a goal kick up against Yoji e. Phillips. All right. There you go. Header off of Cash Alvarado going in. And I'll be off sides on the meals. There with the kick. This guy has a leg, so we know it's going to be going all the way down the field. Who can get the header? Looks to be a body off of Cash Sharp. I mean, Cash Alvarado. Going in off of J Josh Sharp. Going down. Can Cash can get a header? He gets it off. And it'll be out on the meals. South of the will be throwing it in. Pre putting pressure on them. Fighting, kicking it for <laughs> to get out. That'll be Diego Alvarez with... Now, so far we've seen who has the cleanest touch would definitely be for Josh Sharp. But he's been running around everywhere. Shoot, I'm sure he's tired already. All right, we have some substitutions now. We have two out, two in for Southwest Legacy. They'll be the, though this will be their first subs of the night as we are getting ready. We're hitting the second half of the first half. All right. You'll see how Alma Heights can get it out. out Southwest Legacy is still not going to let them. Now it's going to be a corner. Sorry, big, big goal kick. <laughs> Pardon. Off of Ethan Avila. Uh, Alan Moreno finds the Yoji Phillips. Going in off the head of Ayushwarma. Going back down. T. Diego Alvarez, now Jackson Cummings throwing it back in. Going in. Here we go. Josh Sharp down to Galagas. Going up. Trying to get it out. Goalkeep gets it, though. Kicks it. Probably yeah, near the half, near midfield. Going in, I was Logan Baker off the touch. Cash Alvarado. To collision off of the two players, one from Meals, one from Southwest Legacy. And it'll be out. Meals will be throwing it in. Jackson Cummings will be doing that. Looks for anyone who's open. Looks for, as intended, for Diego uh, Madrigal. Going back down. Davila kicks it out to. Uh, to Diego Alvarez. Cash Sharp goes for it. And it'll be a nice save from Ethan Davila. I think that was the, the attempt I've seen from Southwest Legacy so far. Been close. And it'll be out off the head of the OG Phillips. Southwest Legacy will be throwing it in. Well, actually, for the first half, even though there's only one goal so far. All right. <clears throat> Here we go. Alan Moreno. Going to his South Atlantic, he's still putting on pressure. Going back down. 
me out. Alvarez looking for someone to throw it in. Gets it to Antonio for Galagas. Yoji will be able to get it back. He almost trips and falls. And after that, he will get it. Out. Free kick for who's going to be kicking it. Cash Alvarado will be getting this. Goes for it. And up. Going over. Now down to, to the, the goalie. Kick to the good old close to 50 yards off the night off the head of the South Jose's number seven. Al Moreno gets it back. Galagas back to Moreno. Moreno gets it before South Jose. So he kicks it back to Cash Alvarado. Kicks it back to Ethan Davila and sends it down the field. Yoji Phillips here trying to get it. Doesn't look behind him soon enough. And then it's going to be out on South Jose's legacy after almost clipping. I think that was his coach. I think that was his coach he almost took out. <laughs> yeah, look out, man. You're going to take out the guy who, <laughs> who teaches you the good plays. Also, I see one of the ball boys for South Jose's legacy looks to be around four years old. All right, throw in, and I think we have a substitution going. Let's see if he's going off. He is. All right. Going in close, kicks it out. There's some call from the ref getting it back in. Oh, charge. <laughs> All right, I'm on Heights going in. Southwest Legacy coming back down. There you go. Yoji Phillips getting in with a touch. We got charging down the field, and they'll be out off of Southwest Legacy. Goal keep goes for it. To be a throw in. From Southwest Legacy. That was an off the touch. And it'll be out of the meal. So Southwest Legacy will be th doing a quick throw in. Already right, reaching 11 minutes left in the first half. Oh, and, and ugh, Cash Alvarado. And it'll be who's ball. Southwest Legacy's ball. Oh, close attempt by Southwest Legacy, but was saved by the dive from Ethan Davila. Good save right there by the goalkeeper. No, senior, number one. Goes in. Galagas gets the... Goes to try to find... Oh, it'll be out. Quick throw in. Intended for Mod intended for Madrigal. Alvarez will be throwing us in. Josh Sharp gets it off the header. And close. South will say will begin it back in. And it'll be a kick by the goalie. This guy's a leg. You can just hear the pound off the ball while he sends it downfield. And with his strength, not good with his aim. Going to be out. Mills will be throwing this in. Alvarez throws it in to Yoji Phillips. Josh Sharp tries to get it. Going to be off a header. Our number 24, Cole Roos, is be subbed in. Cole Roos is going in. 
Jackson Cummings trying to get it, kick it off to up. Trying it. That was intended for Yoji Phillips. All right, we throw in. Like throwing it in will be Cole Roos, number twenty-four. Sends her down. Off of Southwest Legacy. Yeah, send it down the field. Jeez, Louise. Going back up of the header. Down the field. Al Moreno gets it. Be off. Southwest Legacy will be throwing it in. As we're heading 8 24 left in the first half. Arrow teamed up by Alma Heights. Southwest Legacy kicks it back in. Off of the head of Galagas. Kosh Alvarado gets it to. Oh, Madrigal goes down. I thought you know, you feel Madrigal goes for it. Josh Sharp. You know, Jackson Cummings attacks. And who's he calling it for? Corner kick. And it will be Southwest Legacy. Mules have been putting a lot of pressure on, on them for defensive wise. Now, offensive. Why is it been tr close to be getting in? It? Just when it gets close, they get cornered up, and then you have that goalie for Southwest Legacy who can kick like a field goal from seventy yards. And it will be off of the head. It'll be get back in. Al Moreno going to be down, trying to get to the tack to get on the Southwest Legacy side. I'll go up to it's headed for Yoji Phillips. All right, here you go. Yeah, up and away. Galagas tries to get it. Goes back down. There you go. Alvarez off the off his back. So it says the Al Moreno tries to get for it. Jackson Cummings goes around and kicks it out before the Southwest Legacy can get it. Be a quick throw in. Hands it off to his his friend as the as he's saying up for the play. Throws it in. Kicks it up. Good game for it. Trying to know Diego Madrigo. Hang it off. Get it away. Get, kicks it up. Josh Sharp gets it. Two mules co collided. Trying to get down. Yoji Phillips, Diego Madrigal, and it'll be out on Diego Madrigal. Southwest Legacy will be throwing it in, number 23. Going down. Gets it out. There you go. That'll be Noah Gentles. There you go, Yoji Phillips heads down. Josh Sharp tries to get it. Back for Yoji Phillips. Josh Sharp and Heather again trying to get it back to the Southwest Legacy side. I don't. Galagas is trying to get to it, but it will be out. Southwest Legacy ball. Five minutes 30 left in the first half. I think that first goal was probably something that awoken something in Southwest Legacy because they definitely have not turned off the, the gas. All right, here we go. Gal Josh Sharp going in. Southwest Legacy kicks it back down. Jackson Cummings goes for the header. Tries to get it back. Gonna be out. All right, we got some subs going in. Looks to be Southwest Legacy and also Meals. Yoji Phillips will be out. And I think that's Solomon Nathan who will be going in for him. Yeah, that would be number seven. And there we go. So Owen Nathan gets in for a header, as this would be his first couple of minutes in the game. Off of a chart, <laughs> Diego Madrigal kind of pushes the guy from Southwest Legacy down. All right. And it will be, whistle will be Southwest Legacy's ball.
All right, here you go. Kick from South Legacy on the 30-yard. Oh, points it. He wants it on the 34-yard line. No, not the 34. The 35-yard line. He had a couple of chances to get that correct. Boom for the kick. Off of Alan Moreno. Sully Nathan kicks it back to towards the meals. Cool. Tries to get it out. Kicks it out of the field. Southwest AC ball. Diego Alvarez kicks it back down. And we'll see it there. And it'll be off the boots. Sorry, cleats of Diego Alvarez. Throw in. Going in. Kasha Rock gets the ball. Try to Sully Nathan. Someone Nathan tries to get to back. There you go. And he almost gets tripped by the guy from South Africa. See, Al Moreno has to hit it. And it'll be going out. And offsides call from the ref. Alma Heights gonna be a goal kick. Kicking it up to Cash Alvarado. All right, here we go. Coming in, Josh Sharp trying to book it. Book it. He runs track, but he runs the thirty-two hundred. He doesn't have, but he doesn't have enough speed to get the ball. He is faster than me, though. I'll tell you that. All right, now we're reaching the two-minute warning. Before, and we have some quick substitutions. Josh Sharp will be going out, and we're coming in. We have looks to be Santiago Berenger will be coming back in on the field. He made it. He was the he, so far. He's the only one who has the goal marked on the board. All right, coming in. And it'll be out off of yeah off of the meals. Southwest South Legacy ball. Oh no, meals will get the ball. Quick throwing by Jackson Cummings. And our Southwest Legacy shoves the guy down to the ground. Gallagher tries to get it. And <laughs> hey. oh, we have a free kick coming up. Is be going for the. I think it looks to be Linus Flor Flores will be going for the free kick. Goes for it. Gets it back down. Could be close for a goal. And no. Picked up by si the goalie from Southwest Legacy. Throws it down. Left. Minute, under a minute left to go. Diego Alvarez tries to get it from him. Push it to the ground. Ref calls off the, the foot of Alma Heights. Sounds like he goes for the kick. Number 13. Header off of Josh Sharp. Going down, Diego Madrigal. Ayu Shorma. Going in, Galagas. And offsides. Oh, shoot. Mendela has to go for the dive to save the ball. Way too close for comfort for him. And now we have five seconds left as we're about to end the first half. And there we go. That's the first half for this content. Uh, this con. Uh, <clears throat> This game for the Mules against Southwest Legacy. One nail going in to the second half. We'll have 10 minutes. Now I'm going to do a quick recap of what's going on. Santiago Berenger gets the first goal off of a quick assist from a bunch of people. A bunch of people, but it was a little too close to tell who it was, but I do know it was off the foot of Santiago Berenger. And Southwest Legacy, after the, that goal, got a bunch of pressure going, going on. And keeping it mainly on the side of the meals. Now we'll see if the meals can be able to change their offensive, their their offense going in. Their defense is still getting really too close to comfort for even Davila, and he's been making good saves. And then we have, of course, the freaking mighty foot off of the Southwest Legacy goalie, double zero. Now, 
We're going to leave it off for the second half. We'll give it a half time. You've been watching Meals Soccer Playoffs Round 1 on Online Sports Media. I'm Taj Young. I'll be back for the second half.
Welcome back to the second half. I hope you guys got something else to eat. I sure did. I replaced my quench of drink thirst, which is the only thing I can find in the fridge, which is a Diet Coke, because I need that caffeine and aspartame. <laughs> All right, we're good. Thumbs up from the ref. We're getting it back. I'm Taj Young, getting, bringing you the second half of the boys... Meals soccer versus Southwest Legacy. Josh Sharp kicks it off. We're getting ready. One nil, 40 sec minutes. Let's see this. All right. Quick start immediately. It already broke out to a big frenzy. Oh, jeez. Did you say ricochet off the head of that? Oh, wow. All right, anyways. Okay, Josh Sharp. Back to Yoji Phillips will be in. Still will be in with Jackson Cummings, along with Logan Baker. Handball off of Ethan, off of Galagas. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Greg Monagas. I didn't call him Galagas. It's Monagas. I'm so sorry for the mistake. All right. Here we go. Yoji Phillips trying to get in. Putting pressure on. Monagas coming back in. South Los Angeles again putting pressure. Coming back. Throwing. About Kosh Alvarado going over to Ayush Shwarma. Back to Moreno. You know, over. That was the pass was not meant, was intended for a meal. Did not get it. And then we have. This would be Shashi Gomez. Oh, sorry. No, no, man. Same number, double zero for the for uh, Southwest Legacy. All right, putting pressure on will be Yoji Phillips. Try to get it back. Ayu Shwarma going down to Jackson Cummings. Going back to Cash Alvarado. Runs back. Alan Moreno calls it. He kicks it to Ethan Davila. Going in. Back down to Josh Sharp. To Cash Alvarado, to Diego Madrigal, back to Josh Sharp, who almost gets tripped. Ball still in play. Jackson Cummings, back to Ayu Shwarma, putting pressure. Logan Baker gets it, almost loses it, gets it surroundings ahead. Here we go. Ayu Shwarma, going back. Josh Sharp, back to Jackson Cummings, back to Josh Sharp, back to Cash Alvarado. Al Moreno. There you go. There you go. Monagas gets it. And and be a corner kick. Who'll be going for it? It looks to be Diego Alvarez will be going for this corner. Oh, it'll be a quick play with Josh Sharp. He goes for it. Oh, close. Good attempt by Logan Baker. All right, here we go. Go to down. Be off. Be a kick from South Lex for South Southwest Legacy. And there we go. Have it. 
going down. Oh, Al Moreno. Oh, high hit by Cash. Oh, sorry, that was by J by Cash Alvarado. Ethan Davila will get this goal kick. There you go. Cummings goes to throw in. Put it back to Josh Sharp. To Yoji Phillips. Yoji Phillips loses it. South of the is going down because he get it back. Diego Alvarez gets it back to Monagas. we are throw in. Diego Alvarez. Yeah. South's legacy is trying to put pressure back on the meals to get back on the tack. Meals are still not letting that go. I'm sure Coach Perez talked to him, and they're forced to be kick it back to their goalie. Yoji Phillips goes up to try to pressure him. Are you shawarma? It'll be out. It'll be the meals ball thrown in. Throw in by Diego Alvarez, and it'll be going in back to the goalkeeper. Header off of Cash Alvarado. Josh Sharp tries to get it. Cash goes for it. Goes up by Josh Sharp. Diego Madrigal goes in, and too deep for the, then the goalkeeper gets it. All right, here you go. Pressure put on by Diego Alvarez. Goes in off of Monagas. Josh Sharp tries to run for it to get it. Cummings puts pressure. Goes in, kicks it again, tries to get it. Diego Madrigal tries to get it around through the legs, and it'll be off the shins. Cummings gets it back. Could be another attempt. Oh, loses it by Southwest Legacy. Going in, Cash Alvarado kicks it back. It'll be out. All right, substitutions going in for Southwest Legacy. Number two will be out. Coming in will be number nine. All right. Diego Madrigal. Now we, we have Yoji Phillips. Monagas kicks it back out. Going be out. Stuff like that. See, Yamaha Heights will be throwing it in. Mona guys tries to get a header. Go, we go. Try to break free. Diego Alvarez. Sorry, that was. Kicks it all the way back. And it'll be out on South of the LAC. What? Out on meals, be kick. What happened there? Oh, okay. We'll see what happens. <clears throat> Kicks it in for and close to get back in. Cash Alvarado kicks it all out for Yoji Phillips. Yoji Phillips tries to get it to get open air and oh, close. Not good enough. Monagas goes back down and it'll be out on the meals by Monagas' foot.
Substitutions going in. Number 18 will be going out. Number 15 will be coming in. Throw away by Southwest Legacy. Al Moreno gets it. I'm throwing, yeah. Going back out, deja vu. All right. Throw in. Here's the touch. Josh Sharp does. Going down. There you go. Monagas kicks it all the way for the big man foot. Big bag foot by the Southwest Legacy goal keep. Cash Alvarado tries to get a header. He lets it go past Jackson coming with his right foot. Gets a, gets a touch off. Does get it back out. Southwest Legacy still putting up a fight. He couldn't put pressure. Two man on one. Going back out. Give me the save. Getting close. Josh Sharp does get it. Just, he kicks it out. Logan Baker runs for it. The defense by the meals right there. Logan Baker still putting in pressure. Getting out. Southwest Legacy gets the ball. I guess it was off the foot of, of Logan Baker. All right, Jackson Cummings going back down. You'd be out. Header off of Ayayu uh, Shorma. Yoji Phillips trying to get contested and off the foot of Yoji Phillips. Southwest Legacy ball thrown in by number 15. Number 15 going for it. Number 10, going back out. Number two, sorry, two. sorry to Yoji Phillips. Can Josh, can do, Monagas can be able to get it. Southwest Legacy gets it back out. Yoji Phillips going back in. Just get it out and see the ball. He tackles over him, and it's going to be. Well, it was, it was out. It was going to be a goal kick. Let's we'll see if they have any pizzazz in this one. All right, off of. Handball off of Mills. Summers, I mean, Southwest Legacy Titans will be getting, the Titans will be getting this goal kick, free kick. Coming back down. Ubi out. Looks to be calling for another goal kick for the Titans. Sorry. Be a goal kick. Uh, sorry. Goal kick by the meals. Out on the Titans. Goes it down. Al Moreno goes for it. There we go, Yoji Phillips. Logan Baker tries to get it. Gets in the hands of the goalkeeper. Goes in back down to Cash Alvarado. He gets ahead of the way. Tries to get it back out. Pushes him out. Gonna be out. Goal kick for Titans. Sorry for for the meals. Aaron Moreno. Going down. Cachorrado trying to contest. Going to a good tackle. Jackson Cummings with his. So he's going to pass it in, in the face 
of Diego Madrigal. Going back down to Yoji Phillips. Can get a header. No, he doesn't. South Atlantic he gets a head away. He puts it, pushes it back to the goalkeeper to double zero. Michael Ibuna, by the way, is in the game. Goes in a quick. People gave. Oh, in a. That was a. What just happened? Meals. Titans will get a goal. Now it'll be 1 1 off of a major events after Ethan Davila dives away, gets it away, and then we have Castro Verado trying to get it back. 25 minutes and 11 seconds in the second half for the first round of playoffs. Meals 1. Titans 1. We'll see what happens. Josh Sharp is calling to get this going. As we hear the cheering crowd. I hear the cheering crowd. And we have a sub going in. Going out will be number f six. We have Cash Alvarado coming in for him. Will be Linus Flores. There we go. Going back down. Get it in there. Tries to get it. That was an attempt by Diego Alvarez. Close by no cigar. Let's see if we can get another one. Kick goes in. Ethan Davio tries to get it. Returns back. Off the head of Diego Madrigal. There you go. Yoji Phillips runs for it. And it's going to be out. Throw in. Southwest Legacy. Throw in down. Marino, oh, falls down. Yellow card for for Cash Alvarado. Be a warning for two, and then we have a substitution going in. Coming into the play will be I. I used Schwarmer coming in. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, all right. Correct me. Southwest Legacy will begin to yellow, not the meals. All right, here we go. Goes and kicks it straight down. Josh Sharp trying to get it. Yoji Phillips running for it. No, sorry. That was Logan Baker. And it'll be pushed down. Offsides. Oh, sorry. Lions Flores will be out on him. Oh, wait. Free kick. Free kick. Logan Baker with that header. Going down Josh Sharp. Off. They thought that South Legacy was cheering a little bit early, thinking they were getting the ball after a little conversation with the ref. Turns out Mills will be getting that kick. There we go. Number three, Linus Flores will be going in. Here's the kick. Going close. And, oh, that's, that's a close attempt. Here, goalkeeper will be putting it back in. 
Going back down. Oh, and close intended for Logan Baker. Casarado pulling his way, calling it. Southwest Legacy will get the ball. Be a goal kick. Be off. Be a throw in for the meals. Jackson Cummings going in. Kaj Alvarado be falling down. Southwest Legacy. Jackson Cummings getting it back. Now be Southwest Legacy's ball after that extraordinary of events. Okay, sorry for that. For, sorry for that event. We'll see where the meals have been going on right now. So I he's still putting on pressure. Meals will be getting it back. Oh, the slide. That'll be Diego Alvarez going down and off sides on the meals. Now I can see in the distance. If you look up in the sky, oh, well, you'll be at home watching this. Um, there is looks to be an orange moon looking, looking over Harry B. Arm Stadium on this beautiful night. So that's something cool to look at. Looks kind of scrunched, though. All right. Goal kick. Going in. Going back out. I might be throwing in. And I was I was ca uh, I was cash over earlier with the with the throw in earlier. Uh, South Wales be throwing it in. We get a big header by Yochi Phillips trying to get himself back on the floor. I'm oh, sorry, that was Linus, Linus Flores. Here we go with a, a slide tackle. Would be Yoji Phillips. All right. Substitution being made by Southwest Legacy. Now he'll be taking a throw in. Noah... Gentles is in the game, by the way, from that other earlier sub. Here with a throw in, header, trying to get it out. Noah Gentles kicks it, going back into Southwest Legacy, trying to get it out for the meals. Joe Gentles goes in and, and try to get it. Diego Madrigal tries to put the pressure on, and so does Cash Alvarado. Somehow the ball pops out, and it will be. Mules ball. Jackson Cummings with the throw in. Off of the foot, Cash Alvarado will be back out. Now it'll be Southwest Legacy's ball. 
as we are going to 17 minutes left in the second half. All right, here we go. Alan Moreno going, trying to chase it down. Goal kick. Going in. Cash over Back over. Try your shawarma. Going down. Yoji Phillips trying to get it. Linus Flores be out on the be out on Linus Flores. Southless Lazy will be doing a throw in. Sixteen minutes left. Throws it in. Putting pressure on the meals. Going down. Logan Baker we're trying to get it. Jack Cummins putting too much pressure. Ethan Davila is getting ready off of Alan Moreno's foot. Corner kick. All right, repeat, corner kick. Southwest Legacy is still putting a bunch of pressure on the mules. Trying to get it in. In a corner. Going down. And caught by Ethan Davila. Fake throws it. Game ready. Going in. Clear down. Goes in. Gonna be a break and free. Josh Sharp goes up for it. Gets cornered. Going down. Goalkeeper tries to slide. And he hits the leg off of. Is that Yoji Phillips? It seems to be. Now we have the corner kick by 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 the by the meals. And with 2020 vision, it's kind of hard to see from all across there. I think that's Logan Baker. Oh. See people going in. Tries to fake it. Logan Baker goes out. Goes in for a goal. And off it. Josh Sharp goes down. Goes down for it. And out. Corner kick for the meals. Logan Baker will be going back. There you go. Goes for it. Up. Off header. Being close, putting a lot of pressure. Diego Madrigal. Sorry, Diego Alvarez. You got a touch. You got Diego Madrigal. Gets him to go back in. Almost gets tripped. And he falls. Ref is pointing towards the guy who tripped him. It'll be a free kick for Meals.
He's going down to tie his shoe. That's smart. Double knot. Make sure to get ready for his free kick. All right, let's see this. Going in will be number 10, Joshua Sharp, for a free kick. Off a header, try to get in. Bunch of pressure going on. Can't tell what's going on. Ball's going off everywhere. It's getting close. Josh Sharp going back around. Gets it. Kicks it now, being pressure. And be shoved out of the way. Off. Going to be a, a corner kick. Joshua Sharp is still going to be in the play. It tries again. Goes for it. But it was Diego Madrigal for the free kick. And no good. Sounds like he will be going back. Going in. What in a, what in a bunch? All right, we have some substitutions going on for Southwest Legacy. Meals are still keeping their play going. And another substitution for South of Southeast as we get in play. All right, now we're nearing 10 minutes left in the, in the second half. Going in. Cash Alvarado off the shin of South of Legacy. Oh, Cole Roos is... Sorry, that's not Cole Roos. That's Jackson Cummings. Going back up. Cash Alvarado. Logan Baker going in. That's to uh, Diego Madrigal. To Josh Sharp. To Ayu Shwarma. And just close. Kicked it all the way down the field. Right. Goalkeeper picks it up. Nine fifty left. Oh, he slipped on air. Al Moreno misses the ball. Jackson Cummings goes for it. Josh Sharp also misses, tries to go get it. It'll be back into the foot of the goalkeeper, double zero, header off of Jackson Cummings. Header off of. All right, putting pressure, Diego Madrigal, back to Josh Sharp. Going in, Diego Madrigal, it's going to be a goal. It'd be, oh, he, oh! That was close. So close. Looks to be like the ball slipped under his foot and back in for the where the goalkeeper could be able to keep it. What? A, it's confusing to what just happened just there, but I do know that is going to be a substitution going to be be made. As I see someone at, at the fifty getting ready to be subbed, we'll see who gets subbed. And a trip on. Oh. Look at that. Uh, he looks to be. Ref saw an injury going in. He looks to he's gonna make a sub. Now nah, he looks to be he looks to be okay. Ref is gonna take it back to a drop ball. Going for Alma Heights. Kicks it. 833 left. And offside. Soft of it. Alma Heights. South uh, it'll be Titans ball. All right, here we go. Off of Diego Alvarez's foot. We throw in on South of the Legacy. Going in. And it's going to be well. Sub some substitutions are going to be being made right now. Be a free kick. 
for Southwest Legacy. Logan Baker would be back in the game. He subbed. There you go, Southwest Legacy's ball. Noah Gentles, because it's back to Ethan Davila. Back to Noah Gentles. Kicks it back out to Cash Alvarado. Almost trips and falls. He slides. He goes up. Aish Warmer puts pressure. Diego Madrigal right behind him. Over to Jackson Cummings. And he'll be out on Sir Cummings. 7-13. Goes up. Back out. Al Moreno. Goes in. Logan Baker. Tries to find Noah Gentles. Kicks it up. Josh Sharp going in. And it's going to be in contest with the goalie. All right, throw in, Noah Gentles. Tries to find Cash Alvarado, back out. Noah Gentles will be throwing it back in. He's going. One more time, throw in. Their substitution, Cole Roos is coming into the game. He'll be doing this. We're going in for a throw-in for him. Kind of a little bit long for him. He'll be going in. We'll go in. Oh, cl oh, close for in. It's getting close to the goal. And it's going to be free kick, goal kick for the Titans. Goes in. Cash Alvarado goes for the almost for the header. Al Morena goes for it. There you go. We out. Out on Southwest Legacy. Ethan Davila will be throwing it in. Goal kick. Some substitutions going in. Josh Sharp is going out of the game. We have rested Yoji Phillips. And also we have, who's this coming in? Is that Logan Baker? I guess he was subbed out without me noticing. All right. Here you go. Oh, off of the head, of, off of the cheek. Have I used Schwarma? Going in. Cash Alvarado. Oh, sorry. Josh Sharp is still in the game. Off ahead of Elias Flores. Off ahead of Al Moreno. Going back up. And it'll be out. Noah Gentles will be throwing us in. There you go. And it'll be out. Southwest will be Titans ball. I'll tell you this. I don't want to be that person, but if this, this will go to penalties if no goal is made in the next three minutes. A little bit more than three minutes. All right, here you go. Oh.
I mean, free kick for Southwest Legacy. Going down. There we go. Back up. Oh, close. We're not close enough for Southwest, Le Southwest Legacy. Big goal kick for Mules. Ethan Davila. Goes for it. Back out. Off the body of Yoji Phillips. <clears throat> Are you swarming with a kick? It tackled. By Diego Madrigal. Who pushed down. Two minutes left in the second half. Now, the meals have to get ready for this. Going in. Coming back out. It'll be Southwest Legacy's ball. Go. Try to get out. Al Marina. No. No gentles off of that. Are you Schwarmer trying to get it? He gets dragged down with him. Josh Sharp tries to get it out of the way. He's doing a little shoving, putting it away. No gentles. This is going to be free kick for the Titans. 50 seconds left, less than a minute left in the second half. Here's a kick. You get out of there. Goes in. Kicks it out. You go get for in. Yoshi Phillips. Going back in. To Diego Alvarez. Wait, sorry. And it'll be out. Ten seconds left. Ball boys needs to be hurrying up. Throws it in. Now Logan Baker goes back out to Linus Flores, kicking it, and it's we're going to penalties. End of relegation. Meals one. Titans one. This is end of relegation, but this is no tie, folks. This is playoffs, and also they can not be a tie during regular season either. So it has to be penalties. So five minutes for warm-ups, and then uh, for warm-ups, and then we'll get it. What in the world just happened there? We had an extraordinary events where the meals were able to protect their nets and make sure that the South Legacy could not get. Uh, well, they got close, but they didn't get close enough to be able to get a goal. Now we have five minutes for them to recollect themselves and get themselves situated because we're going to penalties. Now this is not the first time, or. Now, it's been a couple of times where the Meals have gone to penalties during regular season. In fact, I think one of our games went to, that we broadcasted went to penalties. So we're definitely going to uh, definitely be interesting. And there's been times where we've won during penalties, and sometimes we, times we have lost. And that was against MacArthur. So now, uh, now we're going to see what happens. You're watching Meals. Playoff soccer on Alma Heights Sports Media. I'm Taj Young. I'll bring it back to you with penalties.
this is for that. So we have a whole right here, we got this one down there, we got another 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 one down there. Okay, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I'm gonna make a correction to what I said earlier. During the regular season, the rules, what I would say, would have been correct. But for playoffs, there is, each side will, will be two 10 minute halves. There'll be two 10 minute halves. It'll be two 10 minute halves. And if there's, there'll be one, Two minute overtime halftime for it to to for it to let me see what the final score is. Then if it's still tied, it'll go to PKs. I'll explain one more time. There will be two ten minute halves. If they're still tied, it'll go to PKs. That's a little bit more easier to explain. Alright. Let's get ready. Second half uh, I mean first half of overtime. Let's get ready. The crowd is roaring. They're getting. They're trying to get the crowd roaring on the on the Southwest Legacy side. Meals are getting their crowd roaring, roaring on the student section side. We're getting ready. I'm ready. You ready, Bradley? Yeah, uh, he he is. But I'm on a bike. Was waiting for the thumbs up from the ref, and then we can get going. You're watching. I'm Hyde Sports Media. We're ready for overtime. I'm Taj Young. Let's get this kickoff going. And we are off to the races. And immediately sending it soaring in the air. Okay. Josh Sharp is, is still in the game. So is Yoji Phillips is still in the game. Josh gets it. Gets it around. Goes it fine. Tries to get, no. <sighs> it's Southwest Legacy's ball off of Josh Sharp. Going back in. Jackson Cummings. New corner kick. For Alma Heights Meals. Let's we'll see you again, another one. By the way, folks, just want to give you a reminder. If you thought you were about to go, if you're going to go, go to bed soon, well, don't touch, don't touch your remotes because this is still going strong. We'll see this. Could it, could the Meals get another goal in? Josh Sharp goes for it. Can you get around? No. Cash Alvarado. And it'll be Southwest Legacy's ball. Big kick. Now we've seen from the goalkeeper's side, he has a powerful leg. To be able to get it pretty far down the field, no matter where it is. I mean, shoot, he doesn't even look like a high schooler. Jeez. I think he's a senior. And it's going to be out on the meals. Southwest Legacy will be playing it. Now this is playoff madness right here. You think March Madness is crazy? My bracket already busted. This is the best thing I, I have to replace it, is playoffs.
Free kick going in. Sounds like he tries to get around and couldn't. Cacharado with with a good defense there. Getting ready. Rumbling going on from the, from the stands. Going back down. It'll be Yoji Phillips going in, trying to get it back in. Al Moreno. There you go. I use shawarma right there. There is Linus Flores. Back then, Diego Madrigal. Going to try to find. Going back down to the goalkeeper. Going in. Going to be out on Southwest Legacy. Jackson Cummings will be throwing this in. Going in. Try to get it out. This will be a substitution going in. Cole Roots will be going into the game. Coming out. Will be... All right, long throw in by Cole Roos. We're going to try to get in. Off of the header, Josh Sharp. Going back in. Going to be close enough. Logan Baker runs for it. And it's going to be out. On the meals? Oh, right. I forgot. All right. There you go. Off the foot of the goalkeeper, Al Moreno. Gonna save right there. Try to get it out. So he's still in. Al Moreno gets a save. Tries to get it back out. Kicks it back down. Diego Madrigal goes that down to Cash Alvarado. It'll be out. Southwest Legacy's ball. Cash Alvarado. Josh Sharp kicks it back down. And Cash Alvarado's tripped. Ref didn't call anything. Ball still in play. Cole Roos. Oh, yeah, Jackson Cummings will be throwing us in. All right, it's Cole Roosters. Cole Roosters to pull it out. All right, uh, Jackson Cummings going back in. Misses the ball. Going back down. Linus Flores. Linus Flores almost loses control of the ball. He has to get pushed away to Diego Alvarez. Diego Alvarez sends it down the field. And you're trying to put some good pressure right there. Going back to Jackson Cummings. You know, header off of him, of Jackson Cummings. Going back, trying to put pressure, getting the ball away from Southwest Legacy. Southwest Legacy is putting in pressure on the Mules, trying to get in, and he's tackled to the floor. Mules are calling it. We have less than three minutes in this first overtime half. Still one to one.
All right, substitution for Southwest Legacy as this as number 21 is limping off the field. I hope he's okay. Coach Perez is is definitely getting his his players situated, trying to get them ready. Back in play. Try to get the ball out. Off of Southwest Legacy. It's going to be a goal kick for Ethan Davila. Diego Alvarez trying to find Cash Alvarado. There you go, Cash gets it. Going back in, Josh Sharp tries to get it. There you go, Yoji Phillips. Miss is going in for a goal keep. Are you Schwarma trying to get it around? Back to Jackson Cummings. Logan Baker goes. And Yoji Phillips runs down the field trying to get the ball out, and it's going to be out on him. Corner kick. Actually, be out on Southwest Legacy. Corner kick. Logan Baker. As like, about the moon changed color, it was orange earlier, and now it's a little bit shinier. A little more white. All right. Oh, close. <sighs> Bounce it off the one of the posts and hitting the back of the field. Now we're reaching close to a minute left in this first first in this first overtime half. Boom. Less than a minute to go. Kicking it down. Jack is coming to try and go for it. Al Moreno gets a header into his teammates on the sidelines. Throws it down. Going back in. Gonna be out on the meals. Southwest Legacy be doing a throw-in. Quick throw-in because they have 40 seconds left. Going it down. Good defense going in. Kicks it out of there. He doesn't want that ball on his side. Going in, Cash Alvarado. And it'll be Southwest Legacy ball. Getting ready for play. Throws it in. Cash Alvarado gets it. There you go, Phillips. Josh goes for it. Sharpie goes for it. Tries to kick it out. Can he save it? And he's close. And he gets tripped in the meantime. And that's it for the first half. Now, if you want to know. Oh, we have a couple of substitutions. No substitutions. By going in. Sorry, now we have... Two minutes left for this halftime so that they can get themselves some rehydrated, recollected, and gain ready. There you go. What? It's insane what's going on. Meals are, meals are still trying to put pressure on both sides, but no one can get close enough to get in. Let's we'll see if they can be able to continue this as we, as we go into the second half of overtime. We'll be right back. This is Meals Playoff Soccer on Online Sports Media. Now I smile, feeling assured. My choices were not in vain. Locations and situations constantly change, but my unwavering heart remains. For all the trials and all the pain, the mission is, as it's always been, for my son to become a man and live free in his American dream. For the inches, I'm sitting on the bliss. Live on the toilet, I stand on my... Say we ask what you stand on my my shooter a rapper, I sent him a hit. They be on Twitter like when he gon' miss. Say I fell off, but I fell in his boot. The white flag, I ain't telling him. I play it cool and hand broke in a blick. Got your stool just to show you I'm rich. Now you can't drop no new music. How you jump right on that song and it's snitch. You sassy and wrong as a Alright, we are back. Getting list. ready this for the second, second second half. As we have the hype video playing in the background. Welcome to the second half of the overtime. This is Alma Heights. This would be Mule Soccer on Alma Heights Sports Media. 
Crowd is getting wild. They're getting them hype. We're getting for the kickoff. Josh Sharp will be going in. Let's get this ready. Kick. Boom. And fully sending it down the field. Going in. And we'll see who he still is in here. Logan Baker is still in. You're the same with Yoji Phillips. Josh Sharp is still in. Who else is still in? We have Diego Madrigal is still in. Also, seeing Yoji. Uh, J uh, Noah Gentles is still in. Diego Alvarez is also still in. So is Cash Alvarado. And no, and Jackson Cummings, along with. Alan Moreno, and then we have Ethan Davila at goalie. Going in, getting ready. All right, going in. Magic goes tries to get in, kicks it out. Logan Baker tries to get it back. Off the header, off of... Diego Alvarez, Noah, same with Noah Gensels. Going and bouncing it back. Noah Gensels bouncing it. And trying to get it out. Ooh! Out on. That was a really close save by Diego Madrigal, but it wasn't, it wasn't close enough to be able to count it. Sounds like he throws it in. And it'll be out on Yoji Phillips. All right, South Legacy throws it in. Goes it down. Kicks it back to their power mighty goalie. Goes in. Diego Alvarez. Jackson Cummings calling for the ball. Doesn't get it. The same with Logan Baker goes for it. Kicks it into the stands. Right throw in. As I can see, the ball boy climbing the fence to go get the ball in the stands. And we have, oh wow, look at what's going on. Two subs going in. One for Alma Heights, one for uh, uh, one for Southwest Legacy. All right, who, who's still in the game? I think that's, oh my gosh. Good throw. I think that's Cole Roos. And it is Cole Roos as he's charging down the field. All right, here we go. Goalkeeper goes it through. Jackson Cummings tries to put pressure on it for defense. No, Gentle says, no way, Jose. Kicks it out. D Diego Madrigal goes in. Yoji Phillips almost gets it. Goes it back down on the mule side. A slide tackle getting it out. Making it Southwest Legacy thrown in. That was Cole Roos. All right, another substitution for Southwest Legacy. The same with Cole Bruce is now out of the game, and Logan Baker will be checked into the game. As we can hear the crowd cheering for the, for Alma Heights, it's still roaring here in Harry B. Warham Stadium. Oh, this could be trouble for Alma Heights. Do you know, but he's a great save by Ethan Davila. He able to dive in. He almost, no way he's going to let that in. It is too much pressure for that. It's still be 1-1. One, one. And the second half of overtime. As we're nearing the six minute mark. Logan Baker to Noah Gentles. Southwest Legacy going back in. And they're going to be hitting it out. Noah Gentles let, throws it in. Diego Alvarez kicks it out. South, Southwest Legacy throws it in. And we'll see here. Who's still in? Who's still in? All right, Southwest Legacy is still getting ready for a throw in. And it will be back out for another throw in for Southwest Legacy. That's going to throw. 
Goes it back in. Cash Alvarado goes for a kick. So it's Logan Baker going back in for the touch by Diego Madrigal. Jackson, that's right, that's Cole Roos. Going in. Get, got the ball. Getting ahead. It's good. Oh, collision with Joshua Sharpen, the goalkeeper from Southwest Legacy. Can Alvarino get this ball? They're chasing after it, and it's going to be out. Mule's ball. Diego Alvarez will be throwing this in. Gonna throw in, and it'll be out. Off a Solom? No. Diego Alvarez is still in. Oh, close in. He be it out, and he does. You know, corner kick. Looks to be Logan Baker will be heading. Oh, sorry, no. It'll be a corner kick for Southwest Legacy, as they also do a substitution. Jackson Cummings is still in. Goes in. Tries to get it out. Get out of the way. Noah Gentles kicks it back to Alan Moreno. Oh, wait. This ball's not in play. You got to get it out. Goal kick. It'll be a goal kick for Ethan Davila. Go back in. Jackson Cummings. Going back out to over to Josh, to Josh Sharp. Over to Linus Flores. And it's going to be out. As a little push. He's trying to throw He throws his hands up. That's not the fault. Cash Alvarado accidentally bumped into the goalie. That's not his fault. It's just an accidental collision. Goalkeeper ties his shoes, double knots. As I can see, Theo Hervey down on the sidelines, shit pumping up the crowd. The student section. Here we go. Kicks it down. Gets it up. Going in. Jackson Cummings took it for it. And it's be out on the mules. Southwest Legacy be throwing in. Goes in. Logan Baker to Diego Madrigal. Back to, to, uh, to Yoji Phillips. Josh Harvey sprinting down the field to see if he can get it. And it'll be going into the crowd. Throw in. My Diego Magic uh, will be out. Sorry, I'll be sorry. I'll be out on Logan Baker. Mule has Mules have barely any time left. They have a minute forty left in this second half of overtime. All right, here you go. Try to get out. Noah Gentles throws in. Diego Madrigal kicks it back to Logan Baker. Over to Diego Alvarez. Sends it four to Cash Alvarado. Jackson Cummings kicks it back. Going in. And it'll be off. Goalkeeper gets it. Off the header. Off another header again. Or Diego Alvarez. Diego Madrigal goes for it. There goes No Gentle sending it back down the line. Logan Baker tries to charge. Putting pressure on the meals. Still on the side. Josh Sharp puts it there again and will be out. Now, Josh is definitely being bullied out there, I feel, I feel like. He's definitely been aggressive when, he, when they can just send two guys after him. He's fast enough to get around, around those guys, but just hard. Okay, Cole Roos is being checked out for, for Logan Baker. 30 seconds left. Can Cole Roos find a way? It'll be a long throw in. 24 seconds left. Can we get it? Can we close? It's be close again. And he called a foul. 14 seconds left. Be a goal keep. 
Ten seconds. Can he be able to keep it alive? Can he be able to keep it alive? Can he send it to the PKs? He sends it in the sky. And there we go. That is time of overtime. That's it for overtime. Now, now the rules go to PKs. I need to find, I don't know how much time they get between now and PKs. Oh, they choose their. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, okay, so now we have to. As far as. That's what I know about the PKs. All right. All right. There's the rules right there, here and from. From Spradley, they'll get. There's no time between it, and as they're choosing their, they're gonna be for their shooters. They're getting re They're getting ready, and then now they're gonna flip a coin and see where they're gonna kick. They flip. Let's see who gets it. Mules gets it. They're gonna be choosing. All right. Oh, so now they flip it. Let's see who wins. So I think. Oh, okay, he got the choice. All right, Meals is gonna be kicking. Let's see where we see where the guy, where to be kicking off of. I guess it'll be kicking towards the wind, so it'll be kicking on the north end of the field. All right, we're all ready for PKs, everyone. Please do not, if you're still watching, I'm gonna tell you this: you're watching Meals Playoff Soccer on Amlight Sports Media. I'm Taj Young, bringing you the action and the coverage. This crowd is getting ready for PKs as we, as it seems to, I feel like, I think it's the Meals who's be kicking first. Yes, it's going to be Meals who are kicking first. Who's up first? It's going to be Josh Sharp. It's going to be their starting kicker for tonight. All right, I'm going to go ahead and take a sip as we get ready. Don't touch that. Don't touch your, your clicker, everyone. Because this game is not over just yet. All right, here we go. First shot, Josh Sharp for the meals. He's getting ready. We'll see where he goes. It would be messy again. It is in! First goal is good for the meals. Josh Sharp getting that first one in. Our goalie is Ethan Davila. Ethan Davila with the kick. He'll be number 15. We've seen action for him. We'll see if he can get a save. And he does! He gets a save! 2-1 meals! All right, coming up, we have round two. We have kicking. Uh, Sorry if I'm, if I'm saying uh, it's kind of hard to see. I think that's Ethan. I think it's Diego Madrigal. Yeah, it's kind of hard to see. It's number, that's Ethan, that's, yeah. That's number eight. 
Oh, wait, that's it. That's Diego Alvarez. It's number nine. Oh, gosh. It's number nine, Diego Alvarez. Let's see it. Oh, no. Save. I was right, that's Diego Madrigal. I'm so sorry. I keep on confusing. All right. Diego Madrigal. That was a save. All right. He's never going back in. Round two. Let's see with the kicker. Now, this is the most intense part of soccer. We'll see it. He gets the save! Mules are still 2-1 in PKs. Round three. Who we have coming up? We have Cash Alvarado. Going up for the Mules. All right, we'll see if the Mills can get it. And it goes in! And by the way, that was Diego out. That was Diego Alvarez with that. He made it in. Good on him. Sorry, I called him. I called him Cash uh, Alvarado. It was, Di it was Diego Alvarez. I'm so sorry. It's kind of hard to see from up here. But I know these guys. Three, one, Mules. Let's see it. Can Mules save it? And he lets it in. Sorry, I thought I hit the side. All right, three, two. All right, round four. Now this is definitely Cash Alvarado. There you go. Let's see if he gets this one. He's ready. Let's see it. And... It's saved. Whew. It's still going to be very close. All right, next one. It's very close on this one. Ethan Davila is getting ready back into the net. Let's see. We, we're definitely, it's definitely, I can, it's, the tension's so thick, I can cut it with a knife right now, because this is, is a playoffs to the meals, as is, as is, this guy's riling up the crowd right now. Liking the intention, let's see this, to see if Ethan can be able to get the save. Number 18, for Southwest Legacy. He goes, free attempt, and it's, now it's tied. 3-3. Three, three. Meals, round five, put it in. Jackson Cummings will be going for this one. Now we'll see what happens on this. All right, double zero for Somerset is going into the net, getting ready as Jackson Cummings is stepping back, thinking what he wants to do. He gets ready. He goes around. He kicks. He scores! Bringing the Meals for three. What a good one by the man himself, Jackson Cummings. All right. Ethan Davila going back into the net. 4-3. If he saves this one, it's over. If he doesn't, it brings them to the next round. Let's see what happens. Kicking it is going to be number 12. And it's in. Tying it. 4-4. Four, four. Now we're going in to another round. Here we go. Give me the next round. Getting ready. Here we have. Lane for us. It's in off the crossbar. There's a goal by Sir Linus Flores. Uh, I don't know either on this one. I don't know much about the high school rules. 
I'm assuming it's sudden, de sudden death. Yeah, I would think so as well, because you can't tie in playoffs. It's saved! Mio's win! Mio's win by district championship! Ethan Davila gets the save! There we go! Mio's are win! Mio's win! Mio's win! That's it for the Mio's! Mio's will be by district championships! After PKs! Going in against Southwest Legacy! What a game we just had. What a match. That was intense. I, my heart was beating. My, uh, my hands are shaking right now. It is definitely one of those moments. It is insane to believe that this, that this happened right here on this broadcast. In the first round of playoffs as well, it's definitely an intense one. Now, I wouldn't give it without showing some respect or a bunch of respect to Southwest Legacy because they definitely pulled up tonight. They showed in the fight. They put everything they had. And it's definitely one of these... But this definitely would be one of those matches where the Mules will not forget. Same with the student body who showed up. Okay. Now we're going to calm down. And now what's going to be closing out the show? You have been watching the first round of by district champ by district playoff game for the Mules soccer. Mules will win five to four in PKs. This has been Mules playoff soccer on Alma Heights Sports Media. Let's talk about the crew tonight. The crew tonight has been Max Rooney, who's been controlling the camera and also the, the control room. And also we have our director and coach, John Munoz, and of course, my partner for tonight, filling in. <laughs> filling in, he did good for us on the time keep. And then we have, of course, myself, Taj Young, as your commentator, your play by play, your color, your friend in, in, on the mic. Thank you guys so much for watching. These guys are going to be having a great time cheering and going to be having a great blast. You guys get some rest. Now I'm going to go take a nap after this because this has been something very stressful. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great rest of your week, and remember to and be awesome. Mules will win.